Good morning, mighty men. We're going to start with our Bible reading today. Then I'm going to sing you a new song that I just wrote. And afterwards, I'm going to tell you why this song is significant. And of course, we're going to pray. So let's go. Our Bible reading today is the 30th and 31st chapters of Proverbs. 30 and verse 5 says, Every word of God proves true. He is a shield to those who take refuge in him. And then 31 8 says, Open your mouth for the mute, for the rights of all who are destitute. Open your mouth, judge righteously, defend the rights of the poor and needy. So I'm going to sing you this song and then we're going to talk about it a little bit afterwards. Here we go. I won't sing the whole song, just a portion. In my Father's house there is forgiveness. In my Father's house there is peace. In my Father's house there is room for me. I'm going to my Father's house. Come with me to my Father's house. In my Father's house I am accepted, in my Father's house I am free. I know Jesus has prepared a special place for me, I'm going to my Father's house, come with me to my Father's house. So let me tell you why I wrote this song. God literally spoke to me and he said, write a song called In My Father's House. It hasn't happened to me before, but he did. And so I did, like in an hour I wrote this song. And let me tell you where I sang this song just recently, just the other day, at the bedside of a dear friend who's ready to pass into glory. So when you think about the song, the application to today, or to maybe when Jesus comes, or to that day when we pass into glory. It really has all those applications. So teach us, Lord, to attune our ears to your word, Lord, when you speak. Encourage us, Lord, that you, you have a house that you have prepared for us. And Lord, this friend of mine, and all who are facing this sick circumstance of going into glory, that, Lord, that they would have this encouragement. Lord, we affirm that every one of your words is true, and that you are our shield and that we do take refuge in you. And we pray all this in Jesus' name. Amen. Shalom, brothers.